This clash featured two of the surprise packages of the season so far. Salad dwellers last year, the Eels and Tigers have given fans fresh hope. As the home team today enters ANZ Stadium. Back from suspension, Braith and Astor's first kick was wobbly, but it did find touch. Then Chris Sando hit the pressure button. He goes high and the chase from Sando was good. The Eels were the first to strike and no surprise their best player was on the end of it. As Sando goes across field to Hayne, a bit of room for Jared Hayne, twisting, twisting and scoring. They checked for obstruction and got it right. The try was fair and the four points stood. The skill factor from both sides was on display. Luakaola who bursts through, throws the ball for Richards, who is held by an arm but not for long enough. Now Rowe. Hayne complained he was hit high and late, but the ref wasn't interested in that. The Parramatta fullback responded with his own form of vengeance. Now Hayne dummies and runs and comes out again. Jared Hayne for two. He's there. A first half double to Jared Hayne. And over he goes in the corner. He can find a camera too. Down 8 0, the Tigers kept coming up short of the line and the wrong options were creeping into their game. Joel Luani was looking around considering his options out of dummy half. Nathan Peets was rattled up before the break. And if ever the Tigers needed some help, now was the moment. Austin runs out of dummy half. Blake Austin! He'll get the Tigers going! The Eels going to half time, 8 6 up. The second 40 started with a roller coaster ride, and Fooey Fooey was spinning. Peets for Moy Moy, who's upended. He landed safely. Martin Tapau wasn't placed on report. The Tigers pouncing on a loose ball to suddenly grab the lead. It's picked up by Luke Brooks. Brooks can run. Chased by Moy Moy. Moy Moy on Brooks. And the halfback wins. Luke Brooks. While Hayne was responsible for that, he hit back immediately with a kick for Ken Seo. Hayne chips, looking for Seo, who catches, beats Rowe, runs and scores. But this was a contest that had many turns. The Tigers under the pump until Pat Richards swooped on a Sando pass. The 2005 Grand Final hero will become a hero on Easter Monday 2014. With less than 10 to go, Paras Will Hopawadi was denied a try when number 16 David Gower took Luke Brooks out. But Sammy Ranradra wasn't to be denied. Now to Sammy Ranradra. Sammy freewheeling in ANZ Stadium. And the Eels are in. Now locked at 18 all, it was heading for Golden Point until Brooks stepped up. Luke Brooks pulls the trigger and finds the mark. He's put the Tigers in front by a point, Luke Brooks. Close to full time. Richards converted a penalty from halfway to give his team more breathing space. A gripping game finishing 21-18 to the Tigers in front of more than 50,000 fans. Clinton Fletcher, NRL.com.